Barbecues are an essential piece of kit for summer meals and entertaining. But is gas better than charcoal? What are the most important features and what hidden niggles should you look out for? Keep watching to find the best one for you. Gas barbecues are all about convenience. They heat up quickly, so you're more likely to use them and cleaning them is pretty straightforward. Plus, adjusting the intensity of the heat is easy, so you're less likely to get sausages that are charred on the outside and pink in the middle. However, our tests show that food cooked on some gas barbecues can lack that distinctive char-grilled taste, so you may want to invest in one with lava rocks or flavourizer bars. They're also more expensive than charcoal barbecues, heavier to move and awkward to store. If a smoky barbecue flavour is your priority, then your best bet is charcoal. They are cheaper than gas ones, easier to build and move and tend to take up less space. However, they can be tricky to light and slow to heat. Controlling the heat is also very difficult, so it's easy to burn your food. Portable barbecues are okay for picnics, but choose a two burner gas or medium sized charcoal barbecue to cater for a family of up to six people. For larger gatherings and parties, you might want to consider a three or four burner gas model or oil drum charcoal grill. Some cheaper own brand barbecues can cook well but they tend to be flimsier and harder to assemble than models from more premium brands such as Weber and Outback. Most shops will offer discounts at the end of the summer, so if you can hold off until then, you could grab yourself a bargain. One of the most useful features is a warming rack to keep cooked food warm while slower cooking food catches up. Removable ash collectors and fat drip trays can be a whole lot easier than messing around cleaning the base of the barbecue. Side shelves, base storage trays, tool hooks and condiment baskets can be helpful, but watch out as some are too small or flimsy to be useful. If you're more serious about your outdoor cooking, then roasting food on a barbecue is a great idea. You'll need to choose a model that has a tight-fitting hood, but make sure you check carefully, as some lids are only there to keep the grill covered when it's not in use. These tips should help you with what to look for in the shops, but to find out which is the best barbecue for you and to get access to all of our reviews, sign up with a £1 trial subscription to Witch. Well, first of all, mate, you're looking for something that's a good thickness like this steak here, something that's nice and thick, so when you cook it, you can get a nice caramelisation either side, opposed to overcooking. You're also looking for something